just inspired me. I'm about to go home and write some stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna say something. You, you had the anointing. You got it all over you. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just saying. I might. Somebody let me sing them all. <laughs> so we're gonna have the words of inspiration from Lisa Jones. Treatment, not the cancer. There you go. We have to prosper. 
prosper in our relationships. I don't hang with toxic people. I'm very mindful of who I hang with. I surround myself, attach myself to eagles because eagles love to soar, but chickens want to fly. And I don't hang with people who fly. I hang with people who have their hands up reaching for something. They want more out of life. And we have to prosper in our financial. I'm a money coach. It is very easy to be a millionaire in our country, but we don't know money. Because everything comes with instructions but the paycheck. You purchase a toaster, you get instructions. But no instructions come with the paycheck. So payday is temporary millionaire's day. And folks are living paycheck to paycheck, they're living paycheck to Monday. Oh. Because they don't know how money works. And our children duplicate us. Because the children are taught how to survive. Our millennials have no survival skills. Yes. So we have to prosper in those five areas. God said, release me to, to write the book. And then a few years later, he said, now start hosting conferences. And start looking for your circuit of speakers. And it's so amazing. I was being asked to speak and do stewardship seminars for churches. And another speaker would be there. He would say, that's one of them. Okay, now that's one. And I went and approached these speakers. I had a night out with the stars and they came. And I said, God is calling me to host a conference for the family. See, you can go to a women's conference or you can go to a men's conference, but nobody is hosting a family conference. He said, I want them to come in one way. And, go and through the power and the anointing of your speakers, they leave different. So now we have the, fun, the extreme makeover conference for the family. The next one is going to be on Saturday. My table is in the back. Please get a flyer. The flyer is in the book. But I want to encourage you to come to the conference. And our theme this year is called Cycles because we're going through so many cycles in our life. And some of us are stuck. See, cancer is not my story. It's just a scene in my story. And some people can't live out their story because they stuck in one scene. And we're going to teach you how to go through those cycles and get out of those scenes and move on. Because you're called to be great and greatness is in you. But if you don't invest in yourself and put yourself in the room where greatness is being taught, then it'll never be nurtured. Yes. And you'll live a life talking about what you should have done, what you could have done, what you wish you have done. Why is it we're the largest worshiping group of people but the brokest group? Because we don't go and invest in ourselves to better ourselves. And so this conference is going to say, hey, let's have a conversation. So we have a marriage workshop. We have a singles workshop. We have a men's workshop and a women's workshop. We have the general session. I had some of the best speakers in the DMV area. And God said, you're going to impact the DMV area. We have already been solicited to host this conference in California, in Arizona, and in North Carolina, and also Connors and Lisa. Will you bring this conference on the road? So I want to invite all of you to come to the conference. Dr. Green is one of the most amazing speakers at the conference. The awesome, uh, we have over here Mark and Shantae McPhee, who runs the marriage ministry. Uh, uh, the marriage ministry, amen. <laughs> the marriage workshop, speaking those things, right? And, um, and it's absolutely amazing day, vendors. I feed you a bunch of food. You're going to eat well. But it's from 9 to 4 on Saturday the 20th at the Hotel Preserve, a beautiful hotel right up from Merlin Live. You know, you've been to Merlin Live. Just, <laughs> I've seen some of y'all there. Like, <laughs> so come on up and hang out with us. We have registration information at the table. Bring the leaders. I've been blessed to speak all over the world. I'm very successful. God has truly blessed my life. I'm so honored. But one of the things that I make sure that I do is that I go and sit in the room and get my tune-up. Why is it so easy for us to tune up a car, but we don't go and tune ourselves up? See, we tend to go into isolation when we're going through. And I'm telling you, come out of isolation. Come to the conference and let us feed you and give you that tune-up. You will not leave the same. 
I am so honored to be here. I thank you so much for trusting me with the mic. And it's a pleasure to meet all of you. You look absolutely amazing. Thank you so much. No, 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 no,